first unit or the first lesson of this unit we created this little guide that went through all the different types of circle segments and how to handle those and they were very simple so today we're using these same rules for adding harder problems so get this out have it sitting right next to you as we go through these practice problems that are a little more difficult so let's start up here and we're just going to work through these practice problems together and then you're going to have some on your own so here are the first ones let's zoom in a little bit to get a good shot at them okay so here's our first one and this one's fairly straightforward this one falls in which category it falls in the chord chord category so it's just going to multiply chord parts by chord parts so we're just going to take 5 times 15 equals 3 times x so 5 times 15 is 75 equals 3x so x is 25 so that one's fairly easy and at any point in this video you can stop work a problem and then just use my review to check to see how we're doing okay so that one was fairly easy let's look at the second one okay the second one we don't have a right angle so we don't know that's tangent but we do know that this is a radius and if this is a radius then we can draw in our right angle so now we know that segment is tangent okay so that was one of the rules from the last unit about tangents and radius in the circle so now let's apply our rule we have a secant and what's the rule for secant so get out your sheet let's reference it it's exterior times the whole thing so we're going to add the two parts to get the whole thing so outside times whole so let's look at this one we've got six and then the whole secant segment would be six plus eight so I'm going to take six times six plus eight equals or six times fourteen equals our tangent squared okay so grab your calculator if you're not sure I think that's 84 isn't it 6 times 14 yeah 84 84 equals x squared and then we have to take the square root of both sides so that's going to be 4 times 21 which is 2 root 21 and that is the value of x or the length of our tangent up here okay so there are the first two